Hi gang, this is Mike G from Mr. G TV and MrMikeGarner.com talking to you about the Great Reset but not the one that you think I'm going to talk about because if I talk about it, it'll probably get me deleted, deplatformed and lots of criticisms You've got to be aware of what's going on in the world but what I'm all about is being aware of what's going on in here and in here and in here in other words how you present yourself to the world not what's going on in the world let me just tell you something that you might know or possibly you don't know but you have three minds and you have four bodies that's right you have three minds and you have four bodies i could add to that and say that you've got seven energy centers which is your chakras but that's another conversation but your three minds are your conscious mind which is like your desktop on your computer and then you've got your subconscious mind which is like your hard drive which has got all your memories in it and all your operating systems and controls you even though it's running in the background like a hard drive and then you've got your super conscious mind which is like Wi-Fi and it connects you to everything and everybody which is extremely powerful three minds conscious your desktop subconscious your hard drive and super conscious the Wi-Fi and if you want to know more about that then we need a chat but at every time of the day in any moment when you feel like you're losing control you've got to reset those three minds and if you don't understand how to do that then you're at a disadvantage let me just tell you because you'll be doing your best and God bless you for doing your best but unless you've got if you like um, an information manual if nobody's given you the instructions if you don't know what to do then you're a bit in the wilderness and then you've got four bodies you've got this physical body which we identify to but a more powerful body is your emotional body that's centered in your heart and actually has its own vibration its own frequency it has its own holographic expression and it emanates off the body beyond the physical confines of the body this is my outline but you might be able to see an aura here a halo not the time anything special <laughs> but we all have this can you see that okay that's the energy coming off me that's my emanation i'm not talking goo goo gaga -ga. i'm not talking woo woo police helicopters go up into the sky and they can find you hiding behind a wall behind a bush if you've robbed something or done something wrong by looking at you through an imaging camera, a heat seeking camera. And they don't need to see your body, they can see the emanation, the heat the signature, they can see your radiation, which is your auric field. So you have your physical body, and then you have an emotional body, you have a mental body, which is a thought field, which is even more powerful. Thought field, love field, and then you have a spiritual body which is all three of those and more which connects you super consciously using your super conscious mind to everything that is has been and ever will be four bodies spiritual mental emotional and physical three minds subconscious super conscious conscious and in any moment of any day when you're losing the plot you reset all those bodies, all those minds, get them back into a synergy so that you become holistic, so that they all work perfectly balanced together. Because at times you're running on emotions, other times you're running on pure thought, other times it's just purely physical, other times it's energetic, spiritual. That's when you're dreaming at night and you're completely checked out, but your minds are working, dreaming, working out metaphoric allegor um, algorithms and... Um, stories to if you like sort out this filing cabinet of memories and memes and experiences and in that state of dream where you're super consciously connected but you're not aware of it you're actually almost like a genie you are imagining things and it feels real you're bringing things into reality what people don't understand you can actually do that during waking state and that's what i teach and i can demonstrate using hypnosis and mental programming techniques Three minds, four bodies, seven chakras, which I'll talk to you about again. Resetting yourself so that you're always performing at your best. 
you're always balanced, you're always powerful, you're always in control. And uh, I encourage you to check back for more information from me, Mike G. Go to the Mr. G TV YouTube channel, the Mr. G TV Facebook channel, where you're possibly viewing this, where I'll be giving more nuggets of wisdom, which is actually called Gnosis or Occult Knowledge, and Occult Knowledge has been demonised. But trust me, it's good, it's powerful, it's empowering, it's nothing to do with demons and Satan and Occult, which has been... As I say, made to sound bad, occult just means secret, and this stuff is secret knowledge, and that's what I'm here to share. Be powerful, enjoy your mind, understand your mind and your bodies. Three minds, four bodies, and get the best out of yourself in every moment of the day and night. Be powerful. God bless.